Alright guys, I'm Dead Genesis and welcome to White Knight! It is a new game. It's a new kind of game. It looks really cool. It's like this horror or puzzle kind of game. I don't know, thriller or something, murder, but I'm gonna go. It seems pretty cool. And the graphics is pretty cool. Wait and see. I promise it looks pretty cool. So I, I just like, I, I, I need to play it. I needed to play this game. Just for the sake of it. I don't know if I'm gonna make a series out of it. I think I'm gonna make a few episodes of it. And if you enjoy it, I will make more. So you better stick around. Stick around. It's made by Activision and also I'm st studio. I almost say stupido. Some are just pitch black. Without stars, and without sleep. Dirty nights clinging to you like tar. Like this one night, back in 1938. Austin. The Great Depression tsunami was just sweeping over what was left of America. Misery. Hunger. Despair. Times are hard, they said. Times were worse than hard. And the bar was about to close. As far as I was concerned, this was just another intoxicated day drawing to an end. If only I knew. The shock was still echoing in my bones, as the image of that girl coming out of nowhere surged back in my mind. Did I hit her? Was she dead? I couldn't remember. Thoughts were spinning in my head. I hope I didn't run her over. I hope she's still alive. Then, the pain. 
terrible pain on my side. And this question. Where am I? Despite the rain, using L to walk. So, I, uh, okay, I can use the controller. That's ah. Okay, I don't know. Can I just use the wasp? Okay, that's that's better. I think. Can somebody place using space? Okay. The car was on the brink of death. All right. Oh shit! I'm just limping around here. Okay. What? What? What is this? What is this blinky thing? All right. Nothing in the ordinary. What is this? on the road the impact I couldn't find her bother bother bo bother <laughs> the body oh my god my Norwegian is acting up oh. and I burped okay can you just go forth we need to go to that electric box I think seems out of the ordinary gotta check that out the box seems to be connected to electric lighting of the street all right that's good so I don't I really enjoy the graphics of this game. Because it's, it's just black and white. Just fucking hand drawn and. Yeah, you know. For help, we could rely on the Boston Daily News, which I could, could check with Jay. Have I killed her? Who was that girl who crossed the road? I couldn't avoid her, but I never found her body. I couldn't get her desperate stare out of my mind, but I was wounded and I needed help. Alright. All right, can you go faster, dude? We need to check out this gate. Vesper Manor. I didn't didn't ring a bell. I I I, I didn't read all that. I didn't ring a bell. My head was empty and painful. All right, let's just go in then. It's closed. I couldn't get in. I just <laughs> just gonna narrate the guy. So I kept staring at the fucking fence, and then I saw. Dum 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 A way in. I use my superhuman strength to push open the door. This is my new home now. Okay, this is kind of creepy though. I was trying to collect my thoughts, but the intense pain was scattering them like a bunch of dead birds. My fear of being wounded changed into an obsession. Was I about to die? All right, so okay, so what we saw was a ghost. I think that is my theory so far. Do you know, like eight minutes into the game, and we're gonna solve this murder. The controls are really weird here. All right, the arm came from a marble structure. Oh, so this place is for sale. Let's buy this place and live here amongst all the ghosts. Come on, can you just walk up here. You know what this really reminds me of? Sin City. I love me some Sin City. Sin City is fucking awesome, especially the comic novel. There was still some golden liquid inside the glass. Golden? Go golden? Glass was still moist and the chair was overlooking the garden. Someone was there where, very recently, if that person were to come back, my wound would be the only acceptable reason for breaking in. All right. Kind uh, of creepy, but I gotta break in. Hello? Anybody in here? Is anybody in here? I have to use my superhuman strength to break open this door if nobody answers. The landlord was out, so the key might be around here somewhere. Okay, we can find a key. Maybe under the mat. Or are you gonna do it in the cutscene? No, okay. No one around. I was all alone, with my pain growing and some nausea starting up. Where Don't could the stop. key be? Think quick. Think well. Alright, alright, alright. It was right. just an accident. It 
it happens. That can I click that? Made it out alive. I had to make it out alive too. This game is pretty cool, but okay, what is that? A letter from Martha Kenton to William West Vesper. Under normal circumstances, I would have never tried to contact you. I am an honest woman. I have supported my husband since the blessed day of our wedding, from which two, to which two beautiful children were born. I have given them the best education I could, but today I cannot afford to raise them properly anymore. We're ruined. My husband's employer went bankrupt. He is traveling from town to town trying to find a job while I have to beg for food every single day. My four-year-old son has a bad cough, which is getting worse, and I fear for his life. Nowadays, we can see children die in the streets. Is this still America? I beg of you, who are rich. Only a few dollars would be enough. We could work for you. We live in the shack under the best oil sign at the entrance of the slum by the Graham Slaughterhouse. Don't hesitate to come, Martha Kenton. That is really, really sad. No use, that lamp had seen better days. Okay, I wasn't looking for a lamp, I was looking for a key. Someone was here recently. Yeah, I know. I know. But I'm trying to find a key, goddammit. Maybe it's in the cemetery? Since there's a cemetery here. We gotta check this out. Maybe it's on the for uh, for sale sign. I don't know. Let's 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 see. I don't know. It just seems weird. Let's see. For sale. This board looks old. Ask the house. Ass. <laughs> no bad joke. All right. Maybe in the well. No. What did? I... That was quite a drop. Yeah. Oh. What the hell is that? Set? What is? The bucket fell down a dozen meters. At at least no way to recover it thinking this was a premonition was probably just a superstition but i felt definitely uneasy oh yeah okay so this satan mark here on the tree i don't know it's a satan mark but it's some sort of ritual mark thing this unknown symbol let out a powerful aura it's probably you just fucking blood loss and wounding and yeah you know you're not feeling too well there, Mr. Detective, Detective Man. We gotta find a key to get inside. I'm thinking the cemetery. I'm thinking we're gonna go to the cemetery. The cemetery seems like a good place to hide a key. If I had a cemetery in my backyard, I would hide my key there. Because who else? Okay, the arm stretched from opposite, but there was no key in sight. Okay, gotta read. I uh, couldn't help but think about that statue's broken arm. Someone had obviously moved it recently, but I couldn't help thinking it was some kind of... Desecration? Desecration. I don't really know that. I mean, like, it's a the ornament type of thing? I don't know. Whatever. Bear. You may love it. You may hate it. I'm not gonna read that. I'm not gonna read that. It's an advertising for bear. That just makes me want to drink bear. Game is forcing bear on me. Forcing me to become an alcoholic. Okay, so maybe the bench key key. All right, let's check out this statue over here. This game is kind of eerie right now, so I'm just really just want to. Okay, what what? Okay, Margaret Vesper. Whoa, hold on. I could read the name Vesper on the mailbox. That name. No, oh, ever since the commotion, my memory seemed like gone. On the grave, the name Margaret Vesper seemed to challenge eternity itself. Who was she? The grave looked as daunting as a forgotten tomb. What a dire way of decorating a garden. Yeah, it's really weird. Kind of cool. I like it. Alright, let's see. We still need to find that key. B. Norman. This name coming from... No, oh my god, creepy darkness. So right. No... Dude, I'm trying to control you here. I need to go b oh, to that bird bath. Maybe there's a key in there. Oh, thunder. Okay. Key? Nah. No key. There's a bucket. A metallic shard in the dark caught my attention. What do you mean, metallic shard? Where? 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 I don't really know where. Metallic shard? I can't see anything. All I can see is black and white. The key was probably hidden nearby. I think it's in the statue. I think it gotta be in the statue here. Come on, man. Come on, man. Hold it together. You can do this. The statue was staring at me with a wide and hostile stare. It's a statue. 
can't do anything, or can it? Said to have been moved recently. All right. The key gotta be there somewhere. He said it. The key gotta be nearby. You gotta find the key. I don't know why he would think that a key is nearby. It's kind of weird, putting that assumption. Like, okay, this house is for sale, uh, and uh, there's a cemetery in the backyard. The key has got to be here somewhere. Like somewhere, the key got to be here. Okay, what is that then? Maybe that is the key. I'm just hitting space like a motherfucker right now. Can't go there. Uh, I'm really bad at trying to find it. Where, where would you hide a key? I would hide it at the doormat, but yeah, you know. I couldn't see one. Henry Westbrook, a relative of the landlord. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, but if I went here, I could go further. I don't know what I'm doing. But that, there's a tiny white piece of dot there. Maybe that's the key. Hello, key? Dude, this game. Can you just show me the fucking key? I need that fucking key, yo. Like, really? Where is that fucking key? I will, I'm not gonna end this episode without finding that fucking key. This is like, this is, the, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a really bad at games right now. Why am I, what am I missing? The steady was staring at me with a wide and hostile stare. All right. Could it be over here then? Like, what am I missing now? Where, where, where haven't I looked? All right, maybe it's not in the cemetery. Dude, if you could just run, this would be over so much faster. Why did you have to go crash your car, man? Okay, the camper arms out here, but there's no key inside. Okay. Alright. There's no key. There's no key here inside. Okay. Where is the key? Alright, 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 alright. Maybe in the here in the back. We gotta, we gotta check the that rubble thing of like planks and stuff. Maybe it has a key, I don't know. Key. What the fuck, man? What the fuck, man? Where's the key? Oh, oh, of course. How did, how did I, didn't I walk past the statue? How did I not see that? Of course. That is why I talked about moving the statue all the time. My God. And that, oh. Okay, now we got a key. Let's get into that house. All right. I had this a is feeling gonna... I was about to desecrate a sanctuary to open the door to a world I didn't belong to. Well, yeah, it's not your house. But whoever lived in there, they would understand. I needed help. Anyone would understand that. Well, I don't know. What if, if there's a serial killer living in there? He won't understand shit. He would just want to chop, 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 and chop you into pieces and make a stew out of you. That is what he want to do. Yeah, he would eat you. But yeah, we got to go in there. So that's the main thing about the game. Can you please... Can you please? Here we go. Let's get into this creepy fucking house in the middle of nowhere and at night. Okay. This is gonna be creepy. I know it. All right. Yeah. Get in and patch yourself up, big guy. We got it. We got an adventure. We got an adventure ahead. Getting somewhere ahead. safe. That's all that mattered. As the doors opened, the mansion seemed to react to my presence. There was a smell. Like a cornered animal. A smell of fear. And yet, I entered the place. Because I had no choice. I was praying to find a phone, or some help. I didn't even bother wondering what happened to prayers when they reached the wrong door. End of chapter one, guys. This is the end of chapter one. Sweet! That is kind of cool. 
Maybe. All right. Can I just? Okay, we gotta see this then. Footsteps. Not leading out, just leading in. Somebody is in here. Oh my god, I'm a detective. I'm smart. You see, you see, I can't see footprints going out the door. Oh my god. I'm gonna quit YouTube and become a fucking true private detective. Nope. I'm dumb as shit. But okay, so. I'm gonna end it here because I have fucking. That's a chapter. Maybe I could play this in chapters. Yeah? Isn't that kind of cool? If I, well, it depends how good I am, but okay. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this. I, mm, I'm kind of enjoying this game, aren't you? Aren't you also enjoying this game? This seems kind of interesting, right? I think it seems kind of interesting. So be sure to stay tuned because I will play more. And if you enjoyed this episode, hit that like button. And if you're totally new here, you better subscribe. It's completely free. Do you hear that? Fucking no money. Can you check out the, just check, click that button and it's fucking free. As all, I love you, and I'll see you guys in the next video. So bye. Bye bye. bye, bye.